the National Treasury and the Ministry of Finance is the genesis of the problems of funding to county governments. And allowing to that, to that challenge, I, I have drafted a bill to which then I'll really need your input. That we must separate the National Treasury or the Treasury, just the Treasury, from the Ministry of Finance. So that the Treasury feeds both the national government and the county governments. You come to a situation where the, the Ministry of Finance and the Treasury are one and the same thing and they are expected to feed both levels of government uh, equally or equitably. Uh, so for the information of uh, Okia Mtata, it's work already in progress and I hope that this House will support that move. I thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker. You can see the Bishop has spoken with authority. And I'm most uh, happy that there's work ongoing in that region and in that direction. And I would like that you try to borrow on the expertise of some of the most brilliant minds in this country in terms of the structure of devolution and chapter 12, and that's for Dr. M uh, Mukangu. Dr. Mukangu has done a lot of work on the constitution and you could really benefit that bill if you can approach him and it's a bill that is long long overdue because if we don't separate the treasury from the ministry of finance devolution is going nowhere and that's the elephant in the room and once we do that then we shall be able to have these 47 administrative units approach the treasury and be served independent of each other but as long as the national government Things that it owns companies, it, it is the financier of counties, then counties are going nowhere. And that's why I found a statement by the president, welcome as it was that he had released the money, to have been done in circumstances whereby there's a framework that ought to have been doing that work without the goodwill of an individual. We thank the president for the goodwill he expressed and the political action he took to make sure that money was released in the time it was. But if the Treasury was separate from the Ministry of Finance and the Treasury was autonomous, it would have been doing that thing without the prompting of the head of state and the head of state would be left to do more serious work that he's supposed to do in this country. So I really support this the direction we are going, that this uh, additional revenue issue has been brought to the Parliament, to the Senate, it did not, not, not just end up as a question of the National Assembly. But going forward, even the use of the equitable share that remains in the national government must be validated by the Senate. Because the Senate is charged with ensuring equitable development of this country. So the Senate will be able to check and say that maybe counties in Region A are getting the lion's share of this, and that's not correct, we could be able to correct that. So the idea that it's only the, the National Assembly that should supervise the revenue that remain, the revenue share that remains with the national government is not anchored in the Constitution of Kenya. Because that one goes against the principles of devolution, and the Senate has the custodian of devolution, and one of the cardinal issues of devolution being to ensure equitable development of the country. And the national government ha doesn't have its own territory, but carries out its projects within counties. Then the Senate must supervise how that money is used to ensure remarks. I support the bill. And I also want to thank, when I was a few minutes ago, I noticed that one region was fully represented in this house. We had a senator from uh, the Higa, with a senator from uh, Bungoma, with a senator from Kakamega, and a senator from Busia. So the entire Western was fully represented in this house to show that as a marginalized area, heavily marginalized area, but with extreme potential, we take matters of public finances seriously, and we take 
and we are sitting in a, we are in a region whereby all the factories have failed and I 